Thank you. We are taking a closer look at what Mayor Whitmire calls a series of disruptions in an apartment over the past week, culminating in Finner retiring, including an internal HPD email. KHU 11 investigates uncovered, showing Finner knew about the code to suspend cases earlier than he publicly claimed. Jeremy Rogowski broke that story yesterday. He's back with more tonight. Jeremy. Yeah, Len, today Mayor Whitmire said things were, quote, in a lot better shape just about a week ago as the internal affairs probe into suspended cases was all but wrapped up. Then came two major disruptions, including that email, which the mayor called the final straw. At City Council today, Mayor Whitmire didn't mince words. I was sick when I saw the recent email, but I don't have time to be sick. I have to protect this city and lead. This is that email from 2018. It reveals former Chief Finner knew about a case suspended for lack of personnel, despite repeated claims he first learned of the practice three years later. It was a distraction to the mission of the men and women in HPD. And it wasn't the only distraction. Another last week regarding Executive Assistant Chief Chandra Hatcher, who first requested the internal affairs probe into suspended cases. Hatcher wrote she attended a high-level staff meeting in 2021 and distinctly recalled talks of uninvestigated sexual assault cases. The problem? Whitmire says Hatcher wasn't even in Houston at the time. The department was being overwhelmed by the discussion of new information. The mayor said all of it was affecting morale at all levels. It was affecting operations at HPD. That's the bottom line. And with a need to focus back on crime fighting, the mayor said it was time for a change. And while he maintains Troy Finner chose to retire, we wanted to know. In simple terms, was this retire or you're fired? We kept the dialogue going to the point that he retired. Now the mayor said he had hoped to have his in independent review panel provide an interim report on the internal investigation today, but the shakeup at HPD has pushed that back. Glenn? Quite a story. We'll continue to follow it. Jeremy, thank you. Mm -hmm.